Hi guys, it's Cameron from the Mighty Blues. This is my end up match reaction, Everton 2, Lincoln City 1 in the FA Cup third round at Goodison Park. <sighs> Made it hard for ourselves, didn't we? I mean, the first 20, 25 minutes, I thought we were much the better side. We we were looking like the Premier League side. We were creating chances. Adam Ola Luckman had a couple of chances that went, went um, very close to the goalkeeper. And then, obviously, we went 1-0 up. A great ball in and a really good header by Adam Ola Luckman. Looped over the goalkeeper. Uh, is it cleared off the line? Is it not? It, it goes in very clearly. And I think it's a handball, even if it doesn't go in. We then go 2-0 up, another fantastic goal by Bernard, some nice play by Gilfie Sigurdsson and Dominic Calvert-Lewin to put Bernard in and an absolutely quality cultured finish and I think to be honest they were the only two real positives of the game for me, I think, I mean to be, let's not be too negative, we won the game and that you know that's what we needed to do, we won the game and we now progress into the next round of the, um, the FA Cup of course but after that point I think we were just poor mate, I really do, I think we were so poor, I mean another goal can conceded by a set piece this is a league two opposition now with all due respect to lincoln they brought a load of fans and they were up singing and the atmosphere was great but this is a league two opposition and we're conceding a goal from a set piece a ball comes in um you know jordan pickford makes a, a point blank save and then there's three players three lincoln players just standing around waiting to put the ball in the back of the net again concentration is absolutely key in football matches and our players are just standing around expecting the ball to clear itself and it's not good enough and again from that point onwards we just looked poor garner gay couldn't string a pass together for me he wasn't good enough at all in this game gilfie sigurdsson didn't do anywhere near enough said it before the game Gilfie Sigurdsson should have looked like bleeding Maradona today he should have looked absolutely heads and tails above everyone and he didn't he just waltzed around again and he hardly got a shirt dirty he could probably go and hang his shirt up and play in it again next week you know we just weren't good enough I thought Adam Ola Luckman had an okay game don't get me wrong he was in and out in patches but I think every time he got the ball he looked positive and he looked like doing something. Bernard as well played well and obviously he, brought, he, he got that goal that he desperately needed and what a finish it was. Let's hope that he can go and do a lot more in front of goal now because I think that's the only thing that he lacks in his game is, is that cult-edged finish in front of goal. But for me, we, we just weren't good enough all game. I, I think Tom Davis didn't do enough. Like I said, Garner Gay wasn't good enough. The centre-half, Zuma and Mina, I mean, together, I really like Kurt Zuma and I really like Yeri Mina. But today, I think they, they were just very, very clumsy. I really do. I think they were very clumsy. I think Leighton Baines done okay. John Joe Kenny done okay again. But listen, we just weren't good enough today. And I know we've won and keeping the positivity. Let's hope that we can take that momentum on now. But again, we're looking at another game where we've been dominating it and then something's happened in the game aka we've conceded that goal and then heads have dropped and it's just luckily enough that Lincoln haven't got the quality and haven't got the class to hurt us for that because they had a couple of good opportunities they had one headed off the line by Richardson in the last minute if they'd have had the you know the real class and um, to, to to put the ball in the back of the net again then it'd have been another one of them where we're looking going we've started the game well something's happened we've dropped them and you know We've conceded multiple goals, and I just think that's not good enough for me today. Richarlison come on and uh, didn't do much. Cheng Tosin, listen, I like Cheng Tosin as as a foot as a man. I think he's an absolutely you you know sound guy, but. I don't think he's good enough. I really do. Being being brutally honest, I don't think he's good enough to be honest. I think that that opportunity he has, he has about three opportunities, and he needs to go in the back of the net, and he doesn't put any of them in the back of the net. The Ghana gay situation is a troubling one for me. You need a midfielder that can pass a ball, and if your midfielder can't pass a ball five yards, then you seriously need to be looking to bringing someone else in that can pass a ball five yards to re either replace him or to come in when he's not playing well. Because today I thought he was really really poor, and I just think again Calvert Lewin wasn't in the game much, but for me we, we just weren't good enough. Look, we've got the win and we go on to the next round now we'll see how we play and hopefully we can progress further and further maybe that is the win that we needed to you know build our confidence build our momentum but maybe the lads will be going out now in the premier league thinking we've got that win under our belt let's carry on but today it wasn't convincing in any way shape or form and uh, for me it was just a little bit flat again it was flat and it was one of them games where you're thinking this is a little bit embarrassing this these are the lead to opposition at home and you know they we're only beating them 2-1 and even that 2-1 could have could have been a different scoreline if they'd have been a little bit more clinical but anyway, let's be positive. Everton 2, Lincoln City 1 through to the next round of the FA Cup. Let's hope that we, you know, don't get a team much better than Lincoln because I think we'll be in, in real trouble. But let's hope the momentum carries on now and we, and we start to get a little bit more confidence and we carry that result on and hopefully get a, a couple more wins and, and build the points up in the Premier League but wasn't convincing by any means for me today but you know we won and, and that's it at the end of it we can go to sleep happy knowing that we're in the next round but thank you very much for watching Everton 2 Lincoln City 1 thanks for watching